Hi everybody, my name is Caroline. In this video, we're going to talk about flash briefings on Amazon Echo. Now this is your reminder, please do put your devices on mute as I will be using the wake word frequently. We're gonna talk about what is a flash briefing and how you can create your own flash briefing skill for Alexa without writing a single line of code. Now, I have over a dozen Amazon Alexa skills approved and available to you in the Amazon Alexa skill store. And I actually, I was recently featured on the front page. Now I will link to that below if you're interested in seeing those. Now all of those skills were created writing in code. Recently, Amazon has now released the ability for you to use a blueprint, which is creating a skill without code using their templates and submitting for approval in the Amazon Alexa skill store. And that's pretty exciting and a really fast way to make custom skills. I have featured blueprints on my channel previously. I will link to those videos below. Those videos were made a few months ago before Amazon released the functionality to submit your skills for approval so that they're publicly discoverable. Now, why do I keep on using the terminology submit to Amazon for approval for their skill store? Well, my name is Caroline. I represent myself on this YouTube channel. I cannot approve your skill. Uh, it is up to Amazon if they would like to approve your skill or not. Let's talk about flash briefings. For example, um, this is kind of something that you would update every day or every week. This is something that you would say to your Alexa every day. So uh, let me just give you an example right now. Alexa, what's my flash briefing? Here's your flash briefing. From Volley FM, here's your word of the day. Today's word of the day is Cephology. It's spelled P-S-E. So how do you get that configured for your Amazon Echo device? Now I'll show you on my phone here. From my smartphone, I'm going to the Amazon Alexa app. This is the app that we used to set up our Amazon Echo devices in the first place. And we're greeted with a home screen, you know, the last couple things we asked it. And now I'm going to go into the menu button, which is in the top left-hand corner and I am going to select settings. And under settings, there's something called flash briefing. And you see I have the word of the day flash briefing set up under flash briefings. Now I can choose other flash briefings. I can add other flash briefings. I can change the order of the flash briefings by hitting edit and saying, okay, I want uh, word of the day second and NPR first, for example and I can uh, search for more flash briefings by hitting the plus button and hitting search or just uh, scrolling through and seeing what's available. So most of these I would say are news related flash briefings, but you can also, if you have a podcast, this is a great way to get your podcast on Alexa very easily. And I'll show you how to do that in this video. Now that you know about how flash briefings work, let's talk about how to make your own flash briefing. And let's go into, I'm going, and now I've started a screen record and we are at blueprints.amazon.com and I'm already logged in as myself. I'm using the same login and password as I used when I set up my Amazon Echo device. That is very key because you're gonna to wanna to test these things on your device before you submit them to Amazon for approval. Now I've got blueprints.amazon.com and I'm gonna scroll down here until I see flash briefing and it says create a daily or weekly content for your customers. All right, so let's hit flash briefing and it gives you an, a sample which we just heard and now I'm gonna hit make my own. First thing you're gonna to wanna to do is come up with the name of your feed. So the feed name, I'm gonna, I'm gonna say Caroline Dunn blog as my feed. And the category is, I'm gonna say technology. We'll talk about you know, Alexa and we'll talk about technology here. And now we're gonna customize an intro message from Caroline Dunn. Here's your update. Now you've got a choice. If you would like to record custom audio or upload a recording, you can do that, but you're going to have to do that every week or every day as you, so that you can update this because flash briefings are something that you're supposed to do every day or, or fairly often, at least weekly. Other option is text. So you can say, okay, this is my flash briefing for today. To me, the best option is RSS. I'm gonna click RSS and now you've got a choice. You've got a choice between audio or text. If you select text, and I'll show you how to do that first, 
that means it's going to read from a blog. Say I like the business to community website and they have a public RSS feed. So this is business community. They've got great articles. They've got an RSS feed. This is their RSS feed. And if I owned that content, which I don't, I could submit their feed into that URL and they update every, every day. And I would hit um, next. Now, I'm going to point out one very important detail about this feed and about requirements from Amazon. And, if, and once again, I don't work at Amazon and I don't have really any say so in this. I'm just telling you, I'm just a messenger telling you Amazon's requirement is that your RSS feed URL must be secure, HTTPS. Okay, so that's why I'm featuring business to community because they do have an HTTPS. Let's do name. Okay, and the name of this is going to be, I'm going to say Caroline Dunn, just for example, and I'm going to create that skill. So we're going to create that skill and now you're going to see what it looks like when it is simply reading as an example. Okay, so my skill is now created. All I need to do is say, Alexa, what's my flash briefing? Caroline, here are the stories you haven't heard yet today. From Caroline Dunn, here's your update for today. Remember the time when hovering and clicking using the mouse were the most used triggers for interaction with the website? It's simply just reading an excerpt from the most recent published articles on Business to Community, and that's their RSS feed. Okay, okay, that's not bad, um, but it is, just, it is just reading. So let's just edit this and say, what if we had a podcast? And let's, let's go back to here. If I am doing a podcast instead of a text, I would hit audio and then I would enter in the URL for my podcast. Now the example I'm going to show you is from SoundCloud and SoundCloud is a platform in which you can record and publish your podcast. Now I do not, once again, I do not represent SoundCloud and I'm not endorsing SoundCloud by any stretch of the imagination here. I'm just showing you this as an example. So this is my RSS feed from SoundCloud and once again the URL must be secure, HTTPS, and this is, I read this on a um, help ticket or some sort of blog on SoundCloud. They said that you can, it is HTTPS. And so here's my HTTPS RSS feed URL. And I'm going to update my podcast every week. So I'm going to hit weekly. I'm going to update my skill. And now I'm going to say, Alexa, what's my flash briefing? Caroline, as of now, here's what's new with your flash briefing. From Caroline Dunn, here's your update for today. Here's how you get started. First of all, have a goal. And that is a recording about how to start running. So not relevant, I'm just using this as an example. And But I'm showing you, this is pulling directly from SoundCloud, what is the latest podcast I have out there on SoundCloud. That's how you create a flash briefing. Now, if you'd like to make this flash briefing available to everybody, you can submit it to Amazon for approval and hopefully they'll approve it. So let's talk about um, how they go through the approval process. There is something called Help Center right here. I'm going to click on Help Center and I would recommend that you go through this documentation and see specifically publish your skill and understanding their review process. Okay, so um, this is just good to know and following their guidelines that they have. Now I'm going to go into, this is my flash briefing. Now you can just share it privately with people that you know via email or over social media. You can email it or share it over social media. There you go. Pretty simple. Or you can try to publish to the skill store. So I'm going to hit publish to skill store. Caroline Dunn is going to be the name. It's going to be my podcast. And I'm going to hit details. Um, so choose a category. So the category is going to be exercise and workout. Let's just say that and then keywords. Uh, I need to create a skill icon. Uh, if you don't have one to upload, you can create one right here by clicking the create button. And then you want to look for something that's appropriate. And I'm going to choose road. I like the road here. I'm going to choose the background color for background color and I'm going to choose a darker. I'm going to create a border and you can actually move this around if you'd like. I'll move that and I'll hit save. And now I'm creating my skill icon. A skill icon is required for every single skill out there. My short description, let's listen to, and then a detailed description. I will replace that. Listen to Caroline Dunn's weekly podcast here. 
and then I'm going to hit policy and I'm going to say no this is not intended for kids under 13 no there's no advertising I don't have a terms of use URL if you do you need to include that right here I'm going to hit review and then I am going to publish to the store and now I've submitted it to Amazon for their approval and now we'll see if they approve my weekly podcast and that's how easy it is to submit a flash briefing to the Alexa skill hey, store. I'm back. Where we just left off, you saw me submit my flash briefing to Amazon for approval. It was the Caroline Dunn flash briefing. I'm pleased to announce that within a few hours, Amazon approved my flash briefing. And now it is available for you. If you want to check it out, I'll show you how right now. I'm going to start a screen record and we're going to go back to the Alexa app, Amazon Alexa app, the one you use to set up your device. And from the main page here, we are going to go to the menu button in the top left-hand corner. Then we're going to hit Skills and Games. And then I'm going to do a search. I'm going to search Caroline Dunn. And here it is, Caroline Dunn. Listen to Caroline Dunn's weekly podcast here. I'm going to hit Caroline Dunn. And it's now a flash briefing. And it is enabled already. You'll have to hit Enable on your device to get it and you can hit settings, you can hit manage flash briefings and of course the Caroline Dunn blog is the first one on my list here and of course as I showed you at the beginning of this video you can reorder your flash briefings and um, add and delete flash briefings and that is how you can get the Caroline Dunn weekly podcast flash briefing on your device. Thanks for watching and please subscribe. I'll see you next time. Bye now.